Hey, what's up MSP owners? This is Hunter Nelson with Tortoise & Hare Software and today we're going to be talking about why the question how can I generate enough leads for my MSP or how can I generate leads for my MSP is really the wrong question to be asking and um, here's why. The uh, question how can I generate leads for my MSP is really a, a short-term question or implies that there's a short-term problem um, and what I see often happening in the marketplace is that MSP owners will grow to that uh, 10, 15, maybe 20, 25 sort of range and they've been growing through founder-led sales and just doing good work and getting a lot of referrals. Then they experience a little bit of a downturn in business and look around and you know they don't want to let their employees go but you know they got to find a way to fix the sales and marketing problem um, because the referrals aren't coming in Maybe some clients went out of business, they had to leave for whatever reason, change providers, um, you know, whatever the cause of the downturn in business may be. Um, and they turn to Google or their referral networks and start looking at, uh, you know, how can I generate leads for my MSP? And they think, okay, well, you know, we'll just get a few kind of clients in the door here on a short term basis. Um, and then things will kind of go back to normal and referrals will start rolling back in which may or may not be the case, um, but a lot of times what this leads to is um, underspending on marketing, uh, going with some short-term providers such as cold calling agencies or cold email agencies um, that are just going to spam the marketplace, um, you know, make a hundred calls uh, a day um, to a list that they sourced off the internet, uh, put those calls in a spreadsheet and say, hey, look at all the people we called. Uh, and then meanwhile you don't get any leads for your MSP and then you're out you know however much money you spent on the cold calling agency so um, it's definitely one of the most common um, stories that I hear within uh, my sales conversations is we've been working with a cold calling agency or we've been working with a marketing company for the past six months we've got no results now we're out of money. We hate marketers. <laughs> Why are you different? How can you help us? You know, yada, yada, yada. Um, and that's because really it just kind of comes back to that thinking about a lead generation problem as a short term issue and not thinking, you know, more broadly on like, how can I build a brand? How can I build a sustainable source of um, inbound interest uh, to people who want to come and do business with my company specifically. How can I position my service offerings in the market so that there is a, a differentiator? Or how can I you know, do things so much better than the other MSPs in the market that I can offer the services cheaper and attract business that way? Um, and you know, when you start asking those sorts of questions, those are how, how you start generating that, um, you know, stable stream of inbound leads where you have people reaching out to you and wanting to do business with you and you've got a consistent kind of uh, set of awareness in the marketplace and you're consistently reaching new people that are becoming aware of your brand and uh, you really transform your MSP from just an MSP that just does technology services into a sales and marketing driven organization that happens to sell IT services to other companies. Um, so when you start asking you know the right questions there of how can I build the brand how can I generate those that inbound demand and how can I increase the, the brand awareness in the marketplace uh, those are going to be the better questions that help you uh, generate that sustainable source of revenue that's going to carry you um, you know through your MSP's journey and be able to provide for all the employees and other people connected to your business so um, again you know, start stop thinking about how to generate leads and fix that short-term problem within your MSP, and start thinking more broadly on you know how to build that brand, how to position your services, how to uh, increase brand awareness and generate demand for your services, so people are reaching out to you uh, within the marketplace. And when you do that, you'll experience some lasting success. Um, Hope you like this video. If you did, definitely hit the subscribe button below and like, share it with a friend, yada, yada, yada. Uh, and again, I'm Hunter Nelson with Tortoise and Hare Software, and thanks for watching.